I just don't know why somebody would do this. A local woman says burglars broke into her home, stole her stuff, and then killed her dog. Now, I spoke with her at length. She is devastated and can't understand how anyone would take the life of her beloved pet. For 13 years, Kamari the Shih Tzu was family to Darlene Cartarelli. And he slept on my bed with me from day one. Now her house feels empty. Kamari's dog bed's unused, his food uneaten. Darlene can't eat either. She's too overwhelmed with grief. He's my baby. I have no children. That's him. That's him. He's my boy. I miss him so much. God. Smithfield police say someone shot the dog during a July 4th break-in and left him dead on the kitchen floor. I just don't know why somebody would do this. I, don't, I, I can't understand. He was a little dog. There's no way in the hell he could hurt somebody. His teeth were this big. Darlene was out of town visiting relatives and says the intruders also stole two flat screen TVs and money. But she doesn't care about that. I mean, I'd give them everything in this house if they left my dog alone. Instead, she's left with reminders of Kamari's last moments. I found a bull hole in my floor and I found a casing under the chair. I don't know where he was shot. I don't want to know. I don't know if he'd laid here for a period of time or if he was dead right away. I don't want to know. I just don't want anybody to have to go through this. She's begging anyone who knows anything about this to call police. It's anonymous. Just call. This could be your house next time. You know, it could be your house next time. In a neighborhood where she once felt safe, she's changing the locks. But she can't change what happened to the little dog she loved for 13 years. And she wants whoever shot Kamari to know that that little dog would never have hurt anyone. In fact, she says he probably would have tried to play with anyone who came in the house. Well.